Hey guys, welcome back to the another episode or another video. Today's video is really special for me. Today also I'm going to share my screen with you because already by the title you have idea that what I'm going to talk about. It's all about Instagram. Most of the people, they say that you have to do this kind of stuff. You have to do these things, then you will win at Instagram. You will have a huge number of follow-ups. But do you seriously think that do they things matter for you? Have you tested them? I mean, I'm running Instagram my since last year. I, am, I have been growing over 10,000 followers over the, over the last six months only. If I can do that, then anyone can do that. It's not a big thing, but I have tested a lot of things as you are my audience that I have tested many things on you, whether it's my stories, whether it's my podcast, whether it's different type of tweets or whether it's different type of content I post or whether it's my personal thing. thing that everything that was a testing point of view to understand how actually Instagram was. So right now at this stage, I have got a clear idea that at least I have a clear idea that how you should look at the Instagram or what type of matrix you should look at the Instagram because lot of videos are available there. They will tell you that you have to do this thing, go do this thing, have a high rate of engagement and you will have get everything you want. You will grow your follower overnight but this is not something that really matters there are some metrics that you have to look there are different types of content you have to put you have to test a lot of things like personally for my all the international clients i work specifically there are some clients they wanted to grow their instagram so i consult them i help them to grow their their instagram so i have been testing a lot of things so today's video is all about the instagram how i have been doing everything that in the past six months that the actual metrics you should look at then you can decide the when you have to post or when you have to uh, put a different type of content so you will get a clear idea about it so we are not going to waste any more of time it's just like summarization of whatever i did in the last over the year so you will get an idea that basic idea that what metrics you should look at how you should should be posting or how often should be posting how you trigger that emotion all these things are matter like whether it's psychology obviously i also play with the psychology of people psychology or psychology of the audience actually so ultimately unless we trigger that emotion we cannot get them to your profile or get them to follow them get them to follow you so when you have to do it you have to look at the matrix whether uh, how much your account reaches to the audience people so ultimately what happens when you post something it shows to the five to ten percent of your audience if they like or they engage on their post then that it goes to their explore place explore place to the story places uh, then they showing to start showing to your hashtag and different type of so i'm not going into deep into it obviously i have a deep knowledge about it that's why i work with the international clients and I have been getting a good result for it. So I'm going to show you a basic matrix that you should look at it that no one, no one, maybe you, you will see this all type of content the first time. But I really want to share this because I have seen like whether it's my bookstagram friends or book reviewer friends, they have been struggling a lot of to get ultimately followers base or growing their channel. So this is what I'm going to show you. So we are not going to waste any more time. We'll directly go into the, my screen and have a look at it that i'm already talking we are already talking about so i have created some like i have out of that 200 or 200 post i have selected this much for this only post because i cannot make the video more longer even i don't want to make it a more longer more than 20 20 minutes so i have chosen some of the examples that i tested and i wanted to show you that the results that's pretty horrible so let let me just start so this is the first image where I posted about the myself in the few uh, few weeks back about the I went on a trek and I posted this image. You can see that the like were around 500 likes. So this is what I really wanted to talk about. So the interaction were only 10 when the profile visit us went. The discovery is quite less because that uh, was not a, that that was a good pick, but that won't like that's what is not something that will went viral. So even out of that, 27 people were not weren't following me. But you can see that even if the reach is 500, I got that out of 907, I converted 22 into followers. Like if you if you have a business account, you can have the, all the metrics, you can look at it. See the impression is 1000 around you and the from home, from hashtag average. It is pretty normal post. It's not something that big or huge enough. But this is just a basic where I posted about myself and when I was talking about myself. The second pick is this. I posted about the podcast. The like where 
fairly low because obviously podcast is not something that big enough so i don't think that most of the people will understand it but the matrix even the matrix is really really low you can see that the 22 profile visits even the one website click out of that post reached a quite big enough line in 1000 people out of that 30% were in following me but out of that i converted into two followers like you can see the different type of content what works what not but here the hashtag range is good very good see next one this is the trending post like if you have see you have seen this post a lot of time about the linkedin facebook instagram tinder so the even the like is quite good enough but this is what i, what I wanted to show you see that profile visit i got out of this from the hashtag or the from is 19 the post reached around 1700 people out of that 47 people weren't following me but see this number 10 followers i got out of this 10 followers i mean reach is quite good impression is quite good but i got 10 followers i mean this is how high able to scale my everything like when i when i test different types of graphics when i try to test trending posts so this is what i look at i got out of it only 10 followers so it's a good enough post trending top which is always to go with the trend and you can get a lot of followers this is the latest post i mean you have seen the books you should read uh, in the, the fairly good likes but see this there were only 16 interaction posts to reach a very low even the out of that eight percent were in following because most of the people have saved this post out of my like my followers but see this number out of that i got uh, like this screenshot is uh within the one or two hour uh after a posted i pick so after that even like in less than 24 hours this is something i want to talk about like i got followers 27 i mean that's a good number to look at it out of when i post something so this is another post where i posted a caption really really good caption if you have not seen that caption go and read that caption so you will understand so fairly good likes got it the post went good and out of this like from the hashtag it's 500 but i got 19 follows 19 follows 21 profile visit and out of that 22 website clicks i mean that's a good if you are converting a product if you are selling something then you should type your own picture or you should talk about your something that is more important for the audience by this you will get a lot of following this this is something like uh, posted a long back uh, something i came across funny because i wanted to test how a meme or how a humor post works on the instagram and this works really good i mean this is my first trial when i did at that time so at that time my follower count was very low i guess i i was around only five to six thousand followers i guess if i'm not wrong but the followers out of that likes i get very low but look at these numbers this po i i took this screenshot uh, at that, that time so i can see you it's i can I, you can see the results it reached uh, quite low also but out of that 32 percent weren't following but see look at the followers i got out of that because everyone shared that post every that went viral like ultimately that post went viral for me and I'll, this is the result i got out of that only post if i go into insights i got profile visit 1700 around but i got follows out of that converted 172 i mean if you make something shareable content if you make something that people love if you make something that people can relate then you get a huge number this is something or uh, dear future this is something i uh, written a long time back around my second or third year of my college about talking about the few how i look at my future wife so this is also went viral uh you can see that the likes are pretty high you see these numbers i mean literally i got shocked after shock after this thing this this post after this post i i received around seven thousand profile visits i mean if you write something good if you write something relatable then you get a lot of things like see this number i got profile visit 7000 i mean that's a pretty huge as compared to all the things and out of that i converted 72 obviously it's not bad but this is how i able to grow my account so this is the latest post about the book review I, so i'm targeting every other factor like how a book review post works how a humor post works so we are talking about everything this is a book review where i posted uh, insights of the book everything you want to know about the book and why this book is important see this 
this is a quite low after like less than three hours i took this picture i took this screenshot so profile visited i got only 19s but the follows i got converted into two and reach and you can see the impression i mean you can go with the your own post also so this is something i really wanted to talk about when you look at this matrix this is the real matrix you should take consideration when you are doing something posting now you have a better idea that what kind of post you should do i mean now you have a clear idea of what you can do with this uh, what type of content you should post on instagram how you should you can target your audience so hope you find this helpful because this is the real matrix i see when i am growing a profile obviously the other metrics are how many sales are there how many shares are there how many hashtag is used and all other things i will talk about that later if you want that topic put a comment in the description that you want it you want more details about it that how i look at it how i how i see it. so it's not only about instagram i tested linkedin i tested facebook i tested everything even i tested run uh, running ads also so this is something i came across that i have shared only like 15 68 post only but i do have a lot of case studies that i can go on and on on and on but you will get bored so i don't want it so this is some of the metrics that you should look when you are making something so that's all for i guess today's video you hope you have enjoyed this